Hello everybody, welcome to game two of High Elves, uh, down TV to Camry. Bring Burb, which is okay I guess. And he's down a Tomb Guardian, which is great. But there's 12 men and 2 mighty blows, so it's still scary. Oh, his record is pretty bad. <laughs> oh, poor Moradan. <laughs> <laughs> If anybody wants the dick pic that uh, Dimmy sent me, feel free feel free to ask and I'll send you it. <laughs> it's actually it's actually a pretty it's actually a pretty funny one. <laughs> Brutal Morada. Brutal. The LGF. Love it. Doesn't have tackle. So let's go very aggressive. <laughs> Just 50 more tick picks. <laughs> <laughs> very aggressive. I actually didn't go very aggressive. I meant to move him over, but never mind. <laughs> very good, Morita. Very good. Oh. Glodden Cobras. Mm. He's not the Golden Cobras, he's the Glodden Cobras. Who can say if that was a good or bad idea? Slugs. <laughs> the tree almost forgot the name. A lot of people call them Tomb Kings, don't they? I like the uh, Warhammer army. Hmm. I need to think of a better way to make a homemade. Uh, Lampshade and a bit of paper that's about to ignite. <laughs> <laughs> Not my best idea. Oh, there's a guy. There's a guy streaming. I, I wanted to see if he was spinning. I didn't know if he was any good enough. But uh, he's he's got like. He's got a green screen in the background is like a football stadium. That's not a, that's not a terrible idea, is it for a for a blood ball thing? P Diddy. Push me back in an extra block, can I? Okay. <laughs> yeah, physics, that's tipping the goblin, yeah. He's, uh... Well, it was more practical. 
It's more P-Tuber. I don't know what... It's V-Tuber Virtual, right? I don't know what... Let's, let's Google. It's practical effects, isn't it, Tim? Yeah. Yeah, it's practical. He's got a... If V is for virtual, he's practical. He's a practical effects goblin from the 80s. Back in the 1980s. <laughs> he, re he does want to be in the JFW. He's not in yet. But he might be in. Mostly because... <laughs> Who gives a shit? <laughs> Alright, I'll just let... Just calm down, calm down. <laughs> just saying, it's practical effect. I preferred it when things were practical effects. I hate all this CGI nonsense now. Everything looks shit. Things looked so much better when they were practical things, I think. I fucking hate movies now, mostly. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, calm down. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Great nightmare. <laughs> it just I mean, it depends, isn't it? The, the thing with the CGI is, it, I mean, practical effects can look shit as well. Right? But CGI more often looks shit in my experience. Nice turn. Nice turn, mate. Where'd you get it? The shit turn shop? Yep. Yes, that is in fact where I got it. Right, the next dice were at double skulls anyway. Still streaming Blood Bowl 2. Stop that this time. <laughs> yes, uh, physics, but for different reasons. In your case, obviously. Exactly, Brennan Slugs, yeah. Oh, let's have loads of CGI baddies so that no one feels bad about slaughtering people. And then have a same versus same fight with loads of fucking flashing lights. Ugh, God. Ugh. Well, that was the joke. Yes, yeah, yeah, try. That was the joke. Try, yeah. That was the joke. Because it's virtual or practical, but also... Yes. <laughs> that was... The joke. Hilarious, eh? Punching pairs off, glorious. No blitz, feels bad, man. Now we have left a rather gaping hole. Maybe I should have just blitzed there, right, with that block guy, and then he could have come back. But my plan was to blitz with a with a blitzer, but yeah. The bone cube. At least that stun's good. It's 
too easy if people don't get removed every turn, isn't it? Got to make it interesting. Discord links in the description, isn't it? No, must, nobody must uh, look at the descriptions of YouTube videos. Right, what am I doing here? He can punch, he can punch. He can punch. Mexican gym, yeah. I never realised that till you said, Jimmy, thanks. Thanks for that. bit weak here isn't it just a tiny bit I think I want to dodge him out. Just to strengthen over here. Then I can just do that anyway. <laughs> Chain push the ball out, no. Mm. 
Maybe it will screen this. This has been a really boring game. <laughs> Completely boring little children's game. Can't believe it. Pretty annoying, this isn't it? I don't know what to do. I could go out there. Like, this is good that these four being over there, isn't it? But then, how do I. How do I make sure they stay over there? Maybe like this. Did not base the cage, help me. Broke the golden rule of Reddit. Reddit and YouTube. No, I don't know. I don't know how much they say on YouTube. But, um, but there you go. I guess he just stands. And he reconnected a bit. Do I just do the uphill? Because if it's a push, it's pretty grey, isn't it? Don't have the players. Only down two, but can't can't do anything to these. I have no guard or anything. Motherfucker. 
That's something. Yeah. I mean, yeah, Chunder would do it, but half the time he'd get fucked with me. That's the problem. Because it, it's like, it's really unlikely to power, right? So you're mostly just getting the potion. If there'd been more cover behind, like if I had the two players that I'm down, like screen elf screening, then 100% go for it. But like it was just it was just too bad a situation to uh, instantly fail. Also with the turn as well, it being turn seven and this being his last turn breakthrough, which apparently he goes to the uh, trend school of turn counting and <laughs> has not realised that he needs to get in scoring range. So, yep, this is gonna have to be. Gonna have to try something funky to get dice in the ball now. Not gonna have anything in range, is he? I see double dodges. Oh, he's got this in range. He's got this in range. Hmm. If I push him to there, and then I pow him, and then he comes in for the 1D. That really doesn't seem as good. He's just moving him up. See, this is the difference between me and Chunter, right? I roll a one on the dodge and then a one in nine on the hit. You've got to be, you've got to be sensible, haven't you? Find out more about these boobies. Fuck off, Jimmy. From the mighty blow, doesn't it? Glorious to me. Two of the babies, all right, and there is a scoring threat. I guess I'm moving one forward too now. Yeah.
Russian ultimate. <laughs> oh dear. We were talking about when Channel 5 started earlier on. You were, you were there, Steve! You were the only one there! <laughs> HTK was here, I think. Timmy was talking about Channel 5. You know, in the, when Channel 5 started on the TV. And it was, uh... It was... <laughs> they had all of the, the terrible, like... The terrible soft porn movies, didn't they? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Glorious. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the Yanks. The Yanks would, but it it was like it was pretty amazing, wasn't it, when the fifth channel happened, yeah. Yes. It was pretty amazing guys. That was essentially what it was. I mean, it wasn't. They had like they had loads of cheap. Pro they had yeah, not anymore. They had like loads of cheap, shitty TV shows. Um, but in the end, like in the nineties when it started, they had they had a lot of those like late at night as their like USP <laughs> kind of thing. <laughs> Oh, quick snap. <laughs> government mandated soft porn, yeah. <laughs> it wasn't government mandated, but yeah. <laughs> it, wasn't, it wasn't made by the government. I don't know who made Channel 5. Was it, was it Richard Branson? Probably. Yeah, it was the softest ever. Didn't catch it. <laughs> Those were the days. <laughs> I don't know now. I don't know when it started. Like it was a long time ago when it started, wasn't it? So I don't know what the, what it was like then and what it like now it might be totally different, right? I mean, you can base the ball. Ah, not if it goes there, dickheads. Yeah, we had, well, we had, I mean, people as old as Dimmy and I only had five. Well, some people had Sky, right? So there were five terrestrial. Five terrestrials. Like, there was Sky around, but not everybody had Sky. And there was five terrestrial TV channels. That was the fifth one, wasn't it? It was Channel 5. And it was it was proper cheap and nasty. With uh <laughs> with yeah. Really, really bad. Really, <laughs> really, really bad movies. <laughs> that must have been pretty cheap. Yeah, Frosty, it was definitely only some people had Sky, wasn't it? It was pretty rare. Like there were people who like there were people who literally just like stole the dishes to put it on the house to look to look rich. <laughs> uh, 
Probably Hancock. Probably Hancock. Probably probably Store want to look rich. <laughs> <laughs> Just a joke, of course, Hancock. No offence. Not actually a thieving scouser, is he? He's not actually a thieving scouser. It's just a funny joke, like they do on Top Gear. Oh, I can't resist now. He's got to. He's got to attack the dacker. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Is he just putting the Tomb Guardians ahead by themselves? Well, this is an interesting defense, isn't it? I'm not sure it's effective. But it's interesting. Okay, he's bringing noise forward as well. Boys. He's bringing boys forward as well. Daka Daka. <sighs> yes. That's a level for him. God, I love the attacker. It's so good, isn't it? It's such a... It's such a mind-boggling... like, thing. I'd get the mon video demonetized if I played the song. But, you know, you've heard it. You know what it is. It is a glorious way to play a less blood ball. I have potato blood in my veins. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. I have potato blood in my veins. Exactly Irish round there. Exactly. It's brilliant. <laughs> Tato. Fuck off, Jimmy. so good though, isn't it? It's so good. It's such a good strategy. Everyone who doesn't like it is officially shit and wrong. Should put him there now. Could have gone one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That would have been better than that. Right, tag them for a turn. 
or dodge and try to attack him. The undead are uh, just, just sitting on them for a little bit. They're okay, 15 1 1, I think. P's and V's. I didn't, it was only in the chat physics, the P's and V's. I didn't say anything wrong. T A Y T was amazing. Glorious. No, I won't give in. Until I'm victorious. And I will Rando. defend. I will defend. T tantalizing a appetizing Y. Cause we love him T. He is Tato Uo A A A A H O O O H. Glorious. Thank you very much, Dave. And that's it for 19 glorious months. Nearly five whoo beaver pregnancies. Absolutely glorious. Probably now demonetized. Oh wow, he blitzed him. Amazing. Amazing, guys. Yeah, Matt, oh, you already knew that. But you already knew that. I might start streaming more again. I might start streaming more again. Help me, in my humble opinion, one of the best commentators that I've ever heard in my life. There's a blitz there, isn't there? There's a juicy blitz there. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Oh, there's the juicy blitz. goes there. Yeah, he's got that intention first. No, I've got to go there and punch him. Punchy, punchy. I'll spray paint your ass. <laughs> and then this means he can get to there without any dice rolls. Lovely jubbly. Now he can get up there. And he can get up here. Does he want to get out in front? He could do. I guess I'd rather... Oh, he's got to. I shouldn't have done that. Never mind. Oh god, this is really terrible. Um, luckily, I don't think this guy's very good, otherwise this would, this would, this was a horrendous move. Oof. Oof. Why are you, what are you doing here? What are you doing? Ah. The spray paint sound. The story is... Um, Brain on slugs. Watching, um, if you have seen the Batman movie, the new Batman movie, Batman doesn't say it, but uh, the Penguin says it. R like, he says it <laughs> when he's going to shoot somebody. Um, but it doesn't sound, saying I'm going to spray paint your ass doesn't really sound like you're about to shoot somebody with a... <laughs> with a... <laughs> with a... <laughs> with a gun, does it? It sounds like you're going to shoot them with something else. <laughs> so it was pretty funny. And then... Uh, I'll spray paint your ass. And then, <laughs> and then so some of us... Some of us did it in the Batman voice and then made the sound effect of it. 
Exactly, love gun, yeah. Mmm. Indeed. Wow, this is a this is a really uh, powerful defense, isn't it? Holy moly! What a defense! <laughs> it sounds like something else. It does, doesn't it? <laughs> like I don't know why they thought. I don't know if they put that in the movie on purpose. Like, do you know what I mean? As a joke, or if. Nobody got what they'd done, do you know what I mean? Like, it's interesting, isn't it? I don't know which way... Which way it was. The annoying thing is, I don't want to do one, one, one in 81 block, do I? But then if I get the push... Then, uh... I guess I'm still in scoring range. If I go there and I get the push, then I guess I come back and he punches. Ah, oh, fuck it. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Right, so three players, maybe more. Well, that should be okay now. Um, just because I was lazy. <laughs> the only reason. <laughs> the only reason. I just didn't care. Like, they're not going to stop me. It's fucking three skeletons. <laughs> it's just literally, literally three fucking skeletons. <laughs> Absolute, complete disregard for the opponent's chances of stopping me was, was the answer. <laughs> exactly, yeah. Does this even count as a defense? That was the thing. That was the thing. Is that for the sitting goose, Dimmy? <laughs> That's one that should be made for sure. Sitting goose. Holy shit, that was amazing. Screen it before realizing that he, he just can't even base. Ah. 
<laughs> yeah, it was legitimately the best part of the movie. There was the the other thing was uh, Commissioner Gordon kept talking in the Batman voice to Batman, and and once you realised it, you just couldn't you just couldn't like get out of your head. That <laughs> so that was like both hilarious and also completely terrible because it totally it totally ruins the movie once it, and now I've told you so I'm going to ruin the movie for you the, well, once you click that Commissioner Gordon's talking in, in Batman voice every time he talks to Batman it's like hilarious <laughs> and, and you just it, the just movie's over at that point because you're just actually pissing yourself every single time you hear him so there you go there you go <laughs> yeah, genuinely, it's it's just genuinely ridiculous when it well, like once once you clock it, that's it. You just go every single time, every single time. Gordon's talking to Batman. It's just amazing. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> One guy's doing it. Like this. <laughs> so good. Yeah, maybe should. Maybe should rename Batman to Gordon. What the fuck is up with this? Right, so just score? Or risk a 1 in 12, 9, 6? I guess just score. Way. <laughs> Man, high elves are the best, aren't they? <laughs> the sound effects for high elves are just fucking great. Oh shit, I didn't mention about not getting surfed. I've just realised. On the uh, setups guide. Whoopsie. Whoopsie, are literally one of the most important things. Was uh, not getting surfed. I didn't mention it at all. Oh. Oh wow. That was really bad. I guess I can do it in the frenzy guide. That's not a bad idea, is it? Because I need to do a frenzy guide. For sure. The Zons. No, they're terrible, Tim. The Zons are terrible sound effects. Holy shit. They're so bad. They're just literally so bad, the Zon sounds. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> it's horrific. Fuck off, Jimmy. Yeah, I mean the terror—it's terrible. It's—it's it's genuinely not what you want from a game of Blood Bowl, is it? Let's be honest. Like, if you want to listen to those noises, listen to them on your own time. <laughs> Don't put them in a bloody video game, like a sports video game. It's insane. I'll spray paint your ass. <laughs> it's just nuts. <laughs> Sorry, Tim. Just have Pornhub open in another tab, okay, and listen to that. Don't make me listen to it as well. <laughs> like, flip me. GG. No, I didn't even speak to him. Oh, I'm <laughs> to uh, find out more about these boobies. Yeah. I mean, it's not the sound effects, Penemu. Although, although the sound effects don't help, like it's just it's just more of a just more of a boy's hobby, isn't it? And game, that's it. Simple as that. Right, well there you go. One happy days. Lock 
bloody block block. And uh, this guy's dead. Yep. And uh, yep, so he'll key can level next game, hopefully. And then get another catcher, and then get them both blodged up, and then have the third catcher. So there you go, not terrible. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.